Oh, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. Today is a special one. We're going to do a little vlog and I'm going to show you guys a little bit of the warehouse. Yesterday was a huge day. We got a big U-Haul truck, just packed it up and we were unloading and starting to build some stuff. I got a few other things I got to build today. I got to build actually the squat rack. I got to build some standing desks, um, but I got a lot of it done. So I'm going to show you a little bit of the warehouse. We're going to vlog today and we're going to talk about a subject that everybody wants to know. So let's get into today's video. Let's have some fun and uh, let's go check it out. And here we are, the warehouse shorties, the fit body, aka jam, YouTube warehouse. So we're here. So we got a big old door. Um, we got some rubber flooring just laid out. Uh, I started to build a squat rack yesterday. Um, we got some weights. Then we got a ton of boxes we got to go through. Don't even look at it. It's a mess. It's a mess. It's disgusting. Got a fridge. We got our standing desk. One of them built. We need another one. And we got our chairs. And then if you come back here, so these are, this is where all our racks are going to be. So we got a lot more racks coming. Um, clothes, everything. So that's what all these boxes are. There's clothes and there's more coming. So we have our racks. This is going to be Shorty's distribution and inventory, which is sick. I'm fucking pumped. Can I say, can I say the F word? I don't even know. But um, yeah, I got to turn some lights on so you guys can see. But uh, I'm going to start building. I got a lot of work to get done. I got a lot of cleaning. We actually painted the floors yesterday too. And they look good. So, because before it was just like this nasty, ripped up concrete. So anyway, let's get into it today. Let's get into tit. I said tit. <laughs> Yeah. All right, guys, I'm gonna start building this squat rack and then the table, so let's get it. I did it, it's done. The wrenches I was using, that was literally just a grip workout the whole time. Woo! Now, I got this warehouse basically so I can actually, one, I can film my videos really easily. I can actually have some gym equipment in here, one for my coaching app. So this is great for a coaching app, but also I ran out of space for inventory distribution. It was impossible. I was doing everything out of my house for shorties and had no room. I was literally taking up two bedrooms in the living room. So I was like, all right, it's time. So that way we can have a place. I can come, I can work. And then home can be home. It doesn't have to be work and home. That way you can s separate the two, you know? I need that. I need some downtime. Woo! Now to get to these boxes. We're making headway. Check it out. Boxes starting to organize over there. Squat rack. We got the dumbbells and stuff like that going. Uh, now I gotta build this freaking standing desk. It's a motorized one, so it's like this one here where you just press the button and it goes up. These things, man, they just like, they give you the worst tools to try and like actually build the damn thing. Like the Allen wrench they use, it's like, where, why is, like, they need the uh, T1 with the handle. So much easier. L luckily, I got that. Anyway, a lot of you probably wondering the answer to this video, to the title, I guess you would say. Well, one of the titles. We're gonna talk about it, let's sit. Come on, come and sit in my squat rack, here we go. I made a video one time that uh, people were like, oh, you must be, you must be uh, taking trend and all this D-ball, all this stuff. I'm just like, dude, Jesus. If you stop with the keyboard typing and actually just lift the weight over a time of 10, 12 years, you'll start to uh, maybe build some muscle. So here's the deal. I'm natural. I am natty. I've always been natural. The supplements I've always taken are creatine, uh, whey isolate, protein powders. I've eaten right. I've taken my nutrition seriously and I have worked out consistently, literally consistently for 10 to 12 years. I've maybe taken off a rest day. The most amount of time I took off was the time I graduated college. I went on a backpacking trip. That was about a four week trip. I still worked out in between there. So it wasn't a full four weeks off, but I took off. But I've been consistent with this. That's all this comes down to be is consistency. If you can actually lift 
every day, four days a week, five days a week, whatever it is for a consistent amount of time, you're gonna build muscle. You're gonna build muscle, you're gonna look good, you're gonna get to the goals that you want. It's gonna take time, patience. That's literally all it is. That is all it is. But for the trolls out there, I'm sure we'll get a lot of them in this video in the comments that still say, yeah, it's a trombolone sandwich. Listen, guys, get a new joke. Get a new joke. And now the time you've all been waiting for. Booty. I'm gonna show you guys a drop set, a finisher for your buns and thighs that are going to explode them. I'm talking, we're gonna talk intensity, guys. I want you guys growing those legs, thickening them up like a bowl of oatmeal, whatever your goal is. I want you guys to get the tone, the strength, the size. So it's all about intensity. Today, I'm gonna show you guys a quick finisher with the legs. It's a great little drop set. I do this usually after my glute and uh, hamstring days. So that's usually Fridays for me. So today I'm gonna show you guys that. Let's get started. All you're gonna need, usually I do this with 135. So I'll start with a 45. So that's a plate and a barbell. Uh, right now I don't have all my weights. So I'm just gonna show you guys demonstration purposes with 25. All right guys, this is how your finisher is gonna work. You're going 300 reps. Yes, I said it and you're gonna do it. So basically how it's gonna go, usually I have 135 on the bar. I would go four sets of 25. Right after that, I'm gonna shed this. We're gonna go three sets, 33 reps, however many you can get to 100. Then you're gonna go air squats. So then we're not gonna have the bar, anything. We're just going body weight squats. Usually I'll do two sets of 50 or however many it takes me to get there. So let's get to it and let's get crushing our Put sugar on booties. Now, if you're not walking like Bambi or newborn giraffe after that one, you are bionic and you need to up your reps. So, I hope you guys crush this. Get after it. Try this out. You're gonna love it. It's gonna blow up your booty. It's gonna blow up your legs. It's a great finisher. I promise, if you have stairs at your gym, you're gonna take the elevator. So, awesome, awesome job. Get after it. I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, hit that thumbs up for me. Subscribe to the channel. And don't forget to comment below. I'll see you guys next video. Let me know how you guys like the uh, whole vlog style. All right, guys. Later.